I am nothing like your ex-husband. Really? Yeah. What kind of a motorcycle do you ride? A beautiful Holly. You are exactly like him. <laughs> There was a, uh, a casting breakdown notice that came out, and they said, we're looking for a, a character to play a fiancé to, uh, to Fonzie, and we'd like a Linda Pearl type. So my agent called, you know, and they said, well, would you consider seeing Linda Pearl for this Linda Pearl type? So I <laughs> went in, and I auditioned, and oddly enough, I got the role. And so that's how, that's how that came about. <laughs> was it strange? How, how, was, how had the show changed in the years? Oh, the years? well, you know, it, I came in in their 10th season then. So, and I think at that point the show had been past its enormous success. It was still uh, a highly rated show and very successful, but it was past that initial pop of, you know, big starry, you know, success. And Everybody had been through so much together on that show. They had had children. Their children had graduated from college in other cases. Their parents had passed away. They had been marriages and divorces and, you know, big life successes and, and tragedies and all of the rituals of life. They had, they had gone through all of this together besides having this tremendous ride that they'd been on for a decade. And uh, again, so much of, I mean, they were a very closely knit family, uh, in large part, I think, because of Gary Marshall and Jerry Paris. That's just the culture that they nurtured, and it was a good one, it was a healthy one. And so to come back into that uh, was just wonderful, very special, very welcoming. Um, and uh, it was just, it was a wonderful time. Mm -hmm.